I've come to speak with the philosopher Emmanuel Kant. Um, over here, God. My main man, how's it hanging? Good, thanks, G Dog. I've been meaning to speak to you about your formulations for categorical imperative for ages, Kant. But why, great lord? Oh. Same. We've agreed to Kant across eight times already. I need a change. Well, uh, I will explain these formulations. Before we begin, please pick up a whole new hand. There are three different formulations, or rules, that make up the categorical imperative. Ah, I see. Each of these rules must be abided by when a categorical imperative is made. Well, first says, no. Wait. I've got a better idea. That's big, isn't it? First formulation of this is that you must always wish that any act you commit can become universal. If this maxim that you've set is not universalized yet, then you must quickly reject it from your rules of life. If someone else would say that your rules are not the right way to live your life today, then it's not the right from duty. Can I just met you? How can I live my life either? Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. Can will you tell me how I can live my life either? Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. The second formulation is that no life can be shunned for any good conclusion. Humans are ends, not means. Human life should be the aim. No sacrifice can retain the categorical way. Man is not to be harmed when making a decision. There is never a way that we can justify hurting a human, even for a good conclusion. Can I just met you? How can I live? My life either. Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. And will you tell me how I can live my life either? Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. Final formulation is just a combination of the first rules of actions. So listen to me closely. All maxims that we possess need to pass the main test that they can coexist with a kingdom of ends. Any rules that we create need to harmonize with the great kingdom of ends, a theory I made where humans are not used as me. Can I just met you? How can I live my life either? Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. Can will you tell me how I can live my life either? Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. The final theory is really quite important. It's quite important, it's the most important. It teaches that human life is the ultimate goal, ultimate goal, and that all matters should follow.
There are three rules to formulations, and to say this was hard would be an understatement. Cam, I just met you. How can I live? My life either. Categorical imperative. There are three rules, three formulations. So tell me the next one before I lose my patience. Cam, will you tell me how I can live? My life either. Categorical imperative. There are three rules, two formulations. I understand now. Congratulations. And that's my idea. Guy? Is everyone gone?